Okay, guys, welcome back. Kind of intro is so, so badass every time. So we finally we got out of the UAC facility, and well, probably have to go back. You know, I keep I keep talking like I haven't played this game, but uh, you have I probably been the campaign at least ten times. It's just so fun. Look around. I'm also used to playing with all my upgrades. Ouch. Looks like it hurts. Oh, stupid imp. There we go. Makes me sad that uh, because I wanted to have a series well where Daniel and I played through the first two games, and then I would play through this one. I think what happened was we finished the first one, or we finished the first two episodes of the first game, and then we tried doing the third episode, and just it just. One is interesting, our gameplay one, so I never really uploaded it. And also, it's just kind of frustrating to do with the whole two screen bit. that door open now there we go hopefully I don't die too much I prefer not to die the entire time but uh, you know as things happen you know I'll slip down holes that I'm not supposed to there we go those are one of the collectibles Got a grenade. Toss that in. Boom. I'm actually kind of disappointed in the, in the multiplayer for this. For what it's worth, I think every now and then it's still worth it to actually just go in there and have some fun. But uh, one of the things that bothered me was the unlock system for the armor. It wasn't a set progression. So you could get one thing you liked at level 2 and then not get a single thing you liked for the next 3 prestigious lucky for me the DLC armor sets you get are honestly they look badass which I think at one point I wanted to do a snap map series I am just showcasing snap maps and that never really panned out either I have a lot of these ideals like that, they just never, I don't have the time or whenever I do, uh, the game or the game or my software doesn't want to comply, so it gets kind of frustrating. And also we have a map. This is where I started feeling like it was kind of Metroid Prime-esque, because you activate this, you now look at the map, you have your objective. Oh, here we go. They have like these key card things that we can upgrade our suit with. So, okay. We have one, so we can upgrade one of these things. Oh, that requires two.
These aren't available yet. We'll go with this one. Decreases barrel and so I can blow myself with the barrel. Won't take as much damage. Oh gosh. I forgot you can't shoot those. You actually had to activate them. That's a weapon upgrade. See the game, basically this first level is set up to be a tutorial for the rest of the game. Then after that, they kind of stop holding your hand. Here's something you guys probably might have seen. Pull this lever. Door opens. And it's the classic level. The opening of Doom 2. Which, this is only a small part. But... The thing is, those classic levels, you can go back and play the entire level now in the menus. Come on. There we go. Ouch. And it plays it like that and there's a bot featured in my video. So nice, okay. I've been getting really annoyed with those bots lately. Because every every little post I make has them on it and it gets really frustrating. There's anything down here? Don't think so. Well, it has been a while since I played the entire campaign. I've been playing off and on. But this is an upgrade, so. You can choose which one you want. I want the explosive shot. So once you find all of them, you can get upgrades for every weapon. Each weapon has two modifications. Of course, I think, like the super shotgun, you don't switch them out. You just that you stack. And as you play, you can upgrade them and stuff like that, which is pretty cool. Actually, I think I unlocked a weapon point. There we go. So we can upgrade this one, let's see. So, okay, with that, the time it takes to recharge shots is produced. Oh. This feels really good to explore. It's very gory too, which is one of the things a lot of people liked about him. And some of the glory kills are just absolutely brutal. Some armor. There's one imp left. And I, I keep trying to double jump. Because on my main save file, I have the double jump unlocked. You guys are annoying me. It's just really weird to... Well, not weird, it's... Strange, I guess. That one, this is, the Doom is one of my favorite series of games. And uh, the original is older than I am. 
So if you guys don't know, the original came out in 93, I believe. 92 or 93. And I was born in 95. So the game is a couple years older than I am. But, you know, it's whatever. Because I still enjoy it. Still one of my favorite series. One thing that makes me feel old is um, Eli. If you guys have watched my channel in previous years, he is younger than Halo is. And it just makes me feel old. Where's the checkpoint? Just stop blocking my stuff, you bots. Damn. Same thing happens on Twitter too. I get a new I get a notification for a follow, I'm like, ooh, somebody actually it's gonna read my stuff now. Yeah. And it's just another bot. Welcome to the UAC. Now 221 accident free days. Hmm. I feel like it's just uh, a little outdated. But I hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you guys in the next video.